Do so you would you change your position now? Um, no, because I know what I know. Yeah, but you're, you're lying. Stone. You're lying. You are part of the problem. Yeah. You don't deserve to have animals. You do, you do not deserve to have animals in your care. It's incredibly egregious what uh, she's doing, actually. Um, I will not stand for it. I can't believe what I just see. That man there was a kind soul, and we need more people in the world like him. I'll be going down into the gas. We're going to get caught. Wow, look at all the activists here. Whoa, that's a crowd and a half, isn't it? Thanks for coming, everyone. Who watched the documentary? Yeah, yeah. Today, we could do some ways of enticing people who aren't vegan to watch a documentary through the reactions of other people who see some of the scenes that are in the documentary. Have you seen anything like that before? Uh, no, I haven't seen nothing that ah. like that. It's, it's too sad to see that. They are lying to the public about yeah, what they do. I, I, I think so. It's too devastating to see that. Yeah, it's, bless you, my friend. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Yeah. What did you think of it? What did you think of this? Well, I kind of think it's, it's not everyone. I say, like, come on, I raise my own pigs. Do you? Yeah. They, How many pigs do you have? I have two pigs in every acre of land. They have one acre for two pigs. That's hardly nothing. They're cleaned. You... The kids play football. Where do they, them. Where do they go to after you're done with them? Well, we eat them because that's where do they, they No, I was asking where they go. Well, they go to our local abattoir. Okay, and what do they do there? They're injected first, so they're, you know... They eat what? They inject them. To, they inject them with what? I don't know, but it's put them to sleep. They inject them with uh, medicine? Well, something to put to sleep, like you do when you go to the hospital. I don't think that's true or accurate yeah. at all. Are you from Scotland? No, no, I live in, in the UK. Yeah. Yeah, I'm an investigator, so yeah. I've never heard of anyone in injecting yeah. anything. How many pigs do you have? I will only have like six at a time. So you've got six pigs? Yeah. So you don't supply them to the public, general public, obviously? No, no, we just. So, so I'm talking about this here, I took all this footage myself. Yeah. I filmed it all. Yeah, but it's not everything. It's the majority. No, yeah. I don't know. I How do you, okay, so... I'm uh, Sussex, right, and all my friends are farmers, right? And they all raise animals, and trust me, we have sleep I don't want to trust every you. Night. I'm an investigator. Yeah, but so we, 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 I film we this... We set up with our animals all night. Okay. And how are most of them killed? Well, they go to the abattoir. No, what was the last footage you seen, the last clip? Well, not like that. But excuse me, what was the last clip you saw? Yeah, they saw them being gassed. Okay, what proportion of pigs do you think are gassed in the UK? I don't know, I don't know how many are gassed. So 90%. Them. Right. So 90% of gassed. pigs are gassed. But the rest... Nine million of them. Yeah, but the rest aren't kept like that. What do you mean? They aren't kept and then... Uh, so what proportion what? of pigs are factory farmed in this country? But the ones I know... 90 to 95%. I obviously what know What proportion the of mothers are in cages? What proportion of the mothers are in cages? I said, we don't factory farm... I didn't ask if you did. I said, what proportion... You said they're not all like this. I'm just telling you that the majority yeah. is. Right, okay. Right, so, so, what, so you would you change your position now? Um, no, because I know what I know. Yeah, but you're, you're lying. Stone. You're lying. No, I know what I know. I'm an investigator. You don't know anything. I do because I know you got how six pigs on your. You got six pigs, right? Yeah. These pigs are being literally tortured, and the best thing you got for me is it's not all pigs. I've got it's six not, pet pigs, and we they no, get injected. That's a lie. You are part of the problem. Yeah. Because you you're don't telling pe pets. good people that they get injected, they get gassed to death in torture and suffering. Well, so you're lying to people. Lying. They they don't get injected, do they? I don't tell anybody anything. It was all. Are you a farmer? Are you a farmer and your friends are all farmers? A lot of my friends you, you're, are farmers. They're all part of the problem. If they're not telling the public what's actually happening to the pigs, they're liars and, and negligent. Weird. Name their farm for me. No, I'm not going to. Because you don't want to be transparent. This is Norfolk Free Range, right? This place supplies Waitrose with high welfare pigs for years, all right? Norfolk Free Range is a very big uh, free range company. Yeah. Right, and they, they purport themselves as the best. Well, what I'll okay? say to you is it's not 100%. So, so you say one thing, the cameras show another thing. Yes, Do you get it? I'm not showing 100%. And how the hell would you know what happens on farms? Only when you go on to farms. I'm, a, I'm an investigator, right? You're talking to the person Do who filmed you? the... You know, I went into that gas chamber and put those cameras in there, me. Yeah. Yeah. That and, I'm not and you're telling that us that they get injected. So why are you lying to people? But a lot, I'm not lying to it. You are. You said that your pigs get injected. They get, they get shot in the head and stabbed in the throat. 
and look, yeah. still eat meat. Yeah, and you need to stop lying to them and, if you're and pretending that farming is not like this. This is what farming is like. You're not a farmer, and you're lying on behalf of all your farming friends, no, which is negligent and wrong. No, no. I think yeah. you need to come to some of the smaller farms. I've been to small farms. And have you been to small abattoirs? Yeah, because yeah, I investigate we'll small abattoirs as well. Stick a camera in there. Do you watch your pigs get slaughtered? You obviously don't because you think they get injected. Well, I don't actually stand there and watch. Yeah, so you think they get injected, okay, which is an abject lie. Yeah, well. It's a, it's a hilarious joke that you think they get injected. Well, whatever they do. It's yeah, 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 whatever they do. Are they your friends? Are they intelligent? Yes. They're curious? Yes. Playful? Yes. Do they have names? They do. And how do you sleep at night knowing those poor pigs are going to a slaughterhouse? They're getting shot in the head or shocked in the head yeah, that's it. and, and stabbed in the throat. Yeah. And you don't have any conscience about that? No, because I know you're how You're completely I disconnected. You said they get injected, that you're disconnected. I know how I raised them. They're not pets. And how were they murdered? They were animals. How were they killed? Into the abattoir and I trust the people. And you go, bye. Them. You say, see ya. And you think they get injected? Well, whatever they do, they put them to sleep how, and we eat tell them. Tell us how they do it. I don't, I don't go in and watch. Why don't you? Because you don't go in and watch. You take your. Why don't you go in and watch? Because I trust. Because you would rather be removed. No. From what you're doing. No, no. You are killing them. Yes, I know. You're essentially killing them. I know. Yeah. I am. And they're terrified. But that's. What do you think why, it's like in a slaughterhouse? That's why you raise them to eat them. Do you think that's acceptable to raise these animals to slaughter them to eat them when you don't need to? What gives you the right? Well, we've always eaten. What gives you the right? right. That you don't deserve what to have animals. Do you do not deserve have to have animals in your care. Right, what would we do with them if we didn't slaughter them? What would you do with all the pigs? Not raise them. Do you know how farmers raise pigs? Yes, of course they And do. how do they how do they breed them? How do they breed them? Well, anyway, they I'm jack going, off the male animals. They nonce oh, around with them. With me. They, they nonce around with the animals to to breed them. They do. Put the footage on the screen. They do. Completely cold, completely heartless, lying for the industry. Farmers are part of the problem. Huge part of the problem. Perpetuating lies and nonsense, pretending that her pigs are euthanized with an injection when they're literally gassed or electrically shocked and stabbed to death. Lying on behalf of all farmers, it's incredibly egregious what uh, she's doing, actually. Um, I will not stand for it. I'm not going to sit here and have a happy conversation with someone who's outwardly going out the way to propagate lies on behalf of animal killers and animal torturers. Unacceptable. Um, this is not a general meat eater. This is someone with a lot more culpability, which is why my tone was a lot different. And I, I read that straight away. She, um, she watched some of the most horrifying footage just then and said, that's not all farms. I have six peaks. My, they get injected. My, my farming friends, la 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 la, started immediately defending the farming industry, which is my, my, my tone was exactly how it should have been. Completely wrong what she's doing. She, she has no right to go out and lie for the, for the industry that literally tortures and kills innocent sentient beings. And she should know better. And she has blood on her hands. She's killing her animals at her uh, property and she doesn't even have the, the guts or the spine to watch her pigs be murdered in an abattoir. Absolutely unacceptable. I refuse to be gaslit by these uh, manipulators, these farming manipulators. They're gaslighting people. If I was an investigator for years and years and years and knew exactly what I was talking about, she could have easily manipulated me into thinking, oh, she euthanizes them on a happy like sanctuary farm where she has two pigs per acre. Nonsense, lies, manipulators, gaslighters sliders, bad people. Oh. Gathering, your, gathering your thoughts after that? Yeah, it's fucking terrible. Yeah? It's fucking awful. Fucking awful, mate. Yeah. Yeah, it's unbelievable. Do you know what I mean? I can't believe what I just see. And they're going to get prosecuted, are they? Well, which part? Because uh, oh, you're, you're, you've seen a lot of things. You're, you're trying to ban this, aren't you? Is that what this okay. is about? So basically, I filmed all that footage you just watched right, myself. Right. I, filmed, I, I, okay. I went in the slaughterhouse and filmed, I filmed right. all the farm, each right. of those farms. Right. So we're, we're essentially showing people to get together their reactions and their thoughts about it, oh, which right. you've given me yours, which uh, yes. seems to me like you condemn this and are opposed yeah. to it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm and quite shocked. When you go walking down the supermarket aisle and you see pictures of animals and like you look at the labels, is, it's a lot different to that, isn't it? Yes. Why do you think that is? They're trying to promote you, trying to buy it. Not yeah. what is actually behind it all. Exactly. You know what I mean? Exactly. Yeah. So why do you think we're showing people? Yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. Very interesting. And yeah, you're a good man. Oh, thank you. You are, I can tell. Is it, you felt that 
yeah. of what you saw yeah. with the actual with your heart. Yes, which is what we need people f to feel it. You know, because right. uh, right. I took a lot of risk to gather this footage yeah, right. to bring it out to people. Yeah, because obviously, yeah, you must be vulnerable now. Now you've filmed it, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. They're vulnerable. I attack the industry. Oh, they, be, okay. they should be afraid of me. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not afraid of them. Right, good. So we've been protesting them, and uh, I, I exposed the first gas chamber footage in the UK. Right. Before that, this, if you watch this documentary that I have out on Amazon Prime oh, Amazon now, Prime. Right. it's called Pignorant. Right. And this is... this. Can I take a picture? Yeah, of course. Of our kids. Ah, oh, of course. Is that all right? Yeah, go ahead. You can see exactly how the story of how we gathered this and what we're trying to do right. and how the industry and uh, welfare organisations, like, you, would, you wouldn't believe how many are involved with stuff like this. Really? Do you think this is these are isolated incidences or do you think... No, you th no I, I bet it's going on right, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. Throughout the country. Yeah. And not only pigs, I should think other animals as well. 100%. That's exactly right. The same principles you know I mean? apply. When, you, when you're when you mass producing, yes. and animals are no longer treated as animals, so they're treated yeah. as products. Yeah. And uh, you're treated as a, a customer. They're products. You know, and you're right, it, these principles apply to all other industries, which is yeah. why I, I don't actually give them my money at all. Right. I boycott all of the industries that, that use animals. Because... Uh, so you're vegan, is that what you're saying? Yeah, that's another way of putting it, yeah. I'm a vegan. Right. People don't really think about what that is. No. But when you see that, yes. it's just like, I'm making a personal protest. Mm. Because I, if, you, if you found out I had a dog charity, but I was putting all the dogs in the slaughterhouse, you wouldn't donate to me, would you? No, no, without a doubt. So then why do people donate to yeah. people who do this to animals? Mm. That's what you think about. Like yeah. they're giving them, if we, if no one here in England, <laughs> all animal products, all the slaughterhouses, all the farms, all the sh they'd phase out, shut down. Wouldn't exist, they wouldn't have to exist. No, oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Right. Bless you, mate. Well, thank you very much for your on. honest yeah, little reaction. Is that, are you angry about that? Are you angry that they, they've made you buy that? Think about it. Human. Yeah, Human. think about it. They're making you, good-hearted person, compassionate yeah. man, yeah. pay for something like that. Shame on them. Yes. Shame on them. But like, we want people to be outraged that they... Oh, off. Like, yeah. Yeah. I'd be outraged. Yeah. How dare they lie to pe good people? Think about it, man. They're yeah. lying to, like, you know, people with families and children who go in and buy them a ham sandwich. Yeah. They don't know that they've tortured these animals no. to feed to their bloody kids. Yeah. It's a shocking, it's just a moral crime. They should be bloody arrested, these people. Yeah. Sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, that's the attitude and the energy they deserve. You know, the animal abusers, and they're making people like yourself complicit without knowing. Yeah. Okay, we're doing a grand job, Blake. Bless you, mate. Okay. Thank you so much okay. for stopping. Absolute legend. What a great guy, man. He was genuinely affected. And he was like, all other animals too, isn't it? And I'm like, yeah. He was like, really? Good crime, man. He's like, show me the documentary. I want to show it to my kids. What a, you know, people, if you actually analyze the way I speak to people, I talk to people how they are. How do they react to the seeing that horrible thing happen to those animals? What is their attitude towards it? Are they cold? Are they yeah. mocking the animal suffering? Are they compassionate people? And that's how I'll respond to them. If I'm being a certain way, it's usually because the individual have a certain attitude towards animals. You know what I mean? That man there was a kind soul, actually. And we need more people in the world like him. Thank you.